it's weird that although we've, we're both potentially at other ends of the, the world, we're going through the same emotion. To help with the children and to help with the separation and understand, we've actually set up two clocks. So we have what the time is currently at home, and then as Daddy goes through the time zones, we amend the, the other clock so that whenever they need to know what time it is, wherever Daddy is, they can just look at the clock. We've been together 14 years, and this is our fifth deployment. They never get any easier. You just learn little tricks of the trade to help you deal with them. This has by far been the toughest, purely because there's two children involved now. Whereas the last deployment, there was only my eldest. So we're very much a strong family unit and the time apart just, it, it, it's really, really hard, but it makes every single second that he's home that bit more special. The biggest thing that my husband's missed whilst he's been away is our four-year-old's first day at school, which is obviously quite, it's quite big and that's quite an emotional day. I'm so proud of him and the children are so proud. They don't stop talking about it. Everyone knows that Daddy's in the Navy. The children and myself were so excited. Kids are singing that Daddy's coming home, constantly talking about the plans, what we're gonna do, what's the day gonna look like. Every morning we make, wake up and the little is, how many days is it now? How long have we got to go?